Hey everybody, Kim here with another tip on how to properly use the BMW Motorrad Connected app. Now sometimes you might have a problem with the app where you go into it and it doesn't start correctly or maybe it starts and this screen right here looks very pinched down like you can barely read, uh, the, uh, it, you can barely read anything on it and there's no way to zoom it and expand it and make it larger. I've seen that problem. Also sometimes when you come over to the search bar and you select search the keyboard won't come up uh, or you'll try to import a route and the route won't import these are all kind of problems with the app that can be solved uh, fairly easily i'm going to show you how to do that right now so there's a couple of things i want to show you number one if you press and hold the icon on the home page you're going to get this pop-up that shows app info pause app and pin prediction the first thing you want to do is select app info it brings you to this page now, there's a couple of things you want to do on this page. The first thing you want to do is check your permissions and make sure that all of your permissions for allowed include contacts, location, um, and, and your, no your notifications, phone, photos, and videos. Th these are the things that you want to have. You want to make sure everything is, is set up properly to allow this portion of it. If not, if you've got anything down here under not allowed, you want to go ahead and bring it up by hitting allow and allowing it uh, to operate. The second thing you want to do is you want to go to storage and cache and you want to select clear cache. Now, all that does is collect the current stuff. It doesn't it doesn't change any of the user data um, or the uh, storage that you have connected. Uh, you don't want to clear storage because if you clear storage, you'll lose all your maps. So only clear the cache. And the other thing you want to do is under uh, right here where it says for stop, you want to select for stop and that's going to stop the app. Now, when you reopen the app, it'll completely come up brand new. Everything should now be full size. Um, all of your keyboards and things should pop up. Any routes you want to import, you should be able to import things of that nature. So remember that you have that. Also, if you're having any trouble using the TFT or getting it to connect, watch my connected app uh, a video that I have uh, that shows the proper way to set your settings up to have the app connect on the first time every time. And then also watch my video I have that shows how to navigate the connected app uh, on the TFT display. So there you go. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave comments down below. I'll try to help you out if I can. Uh, if you like this video, uh, select like and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thanks a lot. Take care, everybody. Ride safe.